bite. Hi, buddy. You bite a little bit. Sometimes you bite. That was somebody else's. Literally, we had the exact same luggage set. So I helped a guy out. There's my uh, kindness act of the day. God bless luggage tags. See, this is mine. Okay, Justin, where are we headed today? We are going to the Atlas Mountains and the, like the communities of what it, the bear 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 yeah bear 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 and we are going to see what the countryside looks like and ride a couple camels yes and we were so our airbnb host yesterday he kind of laughed when we told him what we were doing today because he made it sound like everything that is promised to us <laughs> Stop it. everything we're doing is not all in the same place allegedly Okay, it's breakfast time. Check this out. Nutella. We're calling this Moroccan Lepsa. <laughs> That's what we've decided. Yes, <laughs> video, yes. So throughout the center square in Old Town Marrakesh, you will find stands like this all over. There's a snake stand, there's a monkey stand, there's a henna stand, there's fruit stands, there's food stands, there's anything you could possibly imagine. But most of them do not give you a price up front. So you need to make sure A, to have cash on you, and B, prepare to negotiate. Because this person wanted 400 dirham, which is 40 bucks. We gave them $5. this green stuff in the middle of the desert. This is the Garden Marjorelli that we took our horse-drawn carriage to, which was awesome. The horse-drawn carriage was totally worth it. I would say coming here for us, it wasn't what we expected. It wasn't as big. We paid $7 each to get in. Okay, so we buy these giant fruit 
smoothie things essentially, but they're fresh fruit, as you can see. Cost us what, two dollars for this giant thing? Like Orange Julius, eat your heart out. We're all geared up. We are ready to rock. I got to pick my color. I am blue on blue. <laughs> denim on denim almost here. Canadian tuxedo, yeah. Berber style. <laughs> we're gonna ride these camels, I guess, in our outfits. And then we're going to the mountains. Dun dun dun. Stay dun dun tuned. dun. <laughs> This seems like a good time for some dialogue. <laughs> so, we paid, it was 20 American dollars, right? For this, yeah. it was an Airbnb experience. So we're getting to ride these camels. I don't know for how long. I think it was a half hour, the other groups before us. And they're taking us out to those mountains. And then that's where we get to go see the village, the Berber village. Um, they already fed us tea and they gave us kind of a little breakfasty cookie. Can we just take a second to look at your eyes? Look at your eyeballs. Mm. Come here, baby. Oh, oh. yes, you see it. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> nom. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> okay, we are now in a yeah, traditional Berber market. This yeah. happens. This happens once a week. So you get what you need, or you wait a week. Because we're there's no tourists here. Just us. Just us. Yeah. These are all locals. Don't drop your phone. That'd be embarrassing. Let's just go get it. It's like a cliff. Okay, so we've arrived at our Airbnb host. He brought us to this restaurant in his village, but his family basically runs it. Check this. A very picturesque picture of our Airbnb group. We're all from France, Germany, Hungary, Greece. Wow. Okay, so we are here in the Agafe Desert. We are going to have tea. I think it's like the third time today. And then there he's taking us to the top. The top of where are we going? <laughs> I forget. The top of something. The top of something and where we will watch the sunset. But check this out, huh? Say hello. Hello. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's, that's, what, that's what videos do. <laughs> Look at this. I met a friendly French person. <laughs> She's very friendly. Ava, right? That's how you pronounce her name? Yeah. Ava? Exactly. You, okay, so we're choosing. So this tea, it's traditional mint Moroccan tea. Yeah. How many times? Have we had it, what, three times today? 
yeah, mm. stuff like this. Yeah, it's complimentary. They give it to you for free pretty much everywhere. But it's, I watched him make it last night. It's, it's black tea, and then he just puts a bunch of mint leaves in there. Mm-hmm. And then there's a little bit of sugar, but I it's... I think it's green tea. No? Maybe it is green tea. It's green tea, I think. She's right. It's green yeah. tea. Uh, of course. Just one thing. Hey, what's up? <laughs> hey! Yeah. Yeah. Video yeah. You don't really hey. understand the culture behind it. <laughs> Stop! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop. This is a great way we're traveling. We get to know, you know, <laughs> yeah. different things. Get out of our way. <laughs> yeah, this, ex this experience is awesome. Because you guys are in so we're basically at this rooftop restaurant because it had lights. You can see it from down low. I think he's got the rest of our food. Yes. Oh, yeah. Another photo? Oh. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> Thank you. Another one? Yummy. Okay, we conquered Morocco. Now we're headed to our next destination. Should we tell them or should we keep it a secret? Tell them. Croatia. We're going to Dubrovnik. We have to go through Lisbon and then we have to go to Frankfurt and then we get there. But I have something to show you here at the end. So Justin here. I'm good at this part. Justin lost his sweater. So Justin had to go and find his sweater. And while he was looking for his sweater, I stood behind the desk as they were checking people into the flight. And I was saying, oh, enjoy your flight, pretending like I worked there. And so the worker actually said, oh, do you want to make an announcement? Of course I do.